I have a question about your expense report. Um, okay. Wanted to see why you spent campaign funds on clothing. Because I'm a, um, a poor small business provider, not usually wardrobe like people would expect a gubernatorial candidate to be wardrobe. What happens to the clothes after the campaign? Charity, I think, is the plan for that. Okay. So you don't see any ethical concern about using the campaign money for clothes? I've got a lot of concerns about the ethics rules in Texas, but that's the rule, and so, no. What, what's the rule? Texas, I don't have any problem with having to report your expenditures. Mm -hmm. I don't have any problem with having to report your contributions. Um, I have a problem with um, the, the, all of the regulations on where we report them. We really do almost require only wealthy people to be able to run for office. Um, it is incredibly restrictive. You know, can't draw any, can't draw any remuneration from. So who pays the light bill and the mortgage and the while you and your family are campaigning for a year? It's near impossible unless you are independently wealthy, or you're like the governor who continues to draw a salary whether he's working or not. And that's, that's the problem we've got in our, in our rules. Um, you cannot be independently employed and run for office without taking a severe financial penalty. So who's got a year's worth of income set aside? And that's, that's the rule. So, do I enjoy having to use campaign funds to pay for my clothes? No. It makes me very uncomfortable. But it's probably more important that I pay my mortgage. And so the campaign's going to get to pay for the clothes that I have to wear and the shoes that I wear out of them.